everyone in this video today I will show you how to transfer word file from PC to Android phone so to do this what you have to do I've explained different type of ways to do this using USB cable Bluetooth and some other method in my other videos so in this video we'll be using another method which is a new method so to do this as you can see right here here is the word file right here next thing for you to do is just to open any browser on your pc then enter your gmail log into your gmail as you can see i'm just logging to this gmail the, the next thing for you is just to make sure you have the gmail log into your phone also so when done the next thing for you to do is just, or, or you can have any gmail log into your phone then make sure you just log into a gmail on this pc so the next thing for you to do is to click on compose right here so when done, enter the Gmail address which you have on your phone. So let's say I have myhanda.com. So you can just enter a subject to hit the Word documents. So when done, just come right here and attach the Microsoft Word file. Just click on this attach file. Then you can then go to the location which is on desktop. As you can see, document one, which is this one right here. Click on open to continue so you can attach it. So when done, you can just enter any stuff right here, the file. So when done, just click on send right here. Then it will be sent. As you can see, message sent. So when it has done sending, the next thing for you to do is just to pick up your phone. Then visit the G open the Gmail, open the Gmail app on your phone. So right now, as you can see, here is the Gmail, here is the file which I just sent recently to the Gmail. You can just click on it to open, then you can then download it, you're clicking on this button right here, to download it to your phone. Let's just click right here to continue. As you can see right now, it's downloading. So, it has been downloaded. As you can see, download successfully. You can just click on it to see the file. On your phone the file has been saved to your phone as you can see it has been saved to your phone and you can open you can also open it on your phone so that's how to do this hope this video or please give it a thumb up and don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel see you in the next video